Breaking news this morning, the largest health care worker strike in U.S. history is underway. Tens of thousands of Kaiser Permanente employees across the country have walked off the job. They're demanding improved work conditions, higher pay and better benefits. They're planning to stay on the picket lines over the next three days. Kaiser says it is working around the clock with the union to come to an agreement. KTLA's Jacqueline Sarkeesian joins us live now outside of the Kaiser in East Hollywood with more. Jacqueline, good morning. Hi, Jessica. Good morning to you as well. Yes, Kaiser says negotiations are still in progress. People have been out here since 5 o'clock this morning. The picket lines officially started at 6 o'clock. So for several hours now, hundreds, if not thousands, of Kaiser workers are at this specific location in East Hollywood. Now, many of these you're seeing right now, they don't work at this specific hospital. They're coming from nearby hospitals, everyone joining together at this location. I'm gonna bring in Deborah Hernandez. She has been working at Kaiser for the past several years. You were telling me a little bit beforehand that what you're seeing right now, this picture, it's sad to you. It's devastating. We were very loyal. We love Kaiser. We're just asking to have a livable wage. It would be different if Kaiser didn't have the money. I cleaned those rooms during COVID. I cannot clean from the outside of the room while doctors were in the nurse's station talking to patients on the telephone. And now you're telling me I'm only worth three pennies on a dollar. That's just inexplicable to me. It's hurtful. I'm not worth a whole nickel. I can't get a piece of silver. What do you have to say? Kaiser released some information saying that specifically Southern California Kaiser employees make more than 20% of non-Kaiser workers. What do you have to say about that? You're laughing. You find that funny. I find that incredibly funny when the exact same union, SEIU, got Cedar Sinai 13%. Now you're telling me I'm only worth three pennies. I'm not understanding the correlation. Perhaps I'm missing something. Yeah. But I happen to know that Kaiser made 44.6 billion. Well, Deborah, thank you so much for your time. Kaiser wants to make it known that they do have contingency plans in place. So if you have upcoming surgeries or whatnot, everything will go on as planned. Emergency rooms and hospitals are staying open during the strike, which is expected to wrap up this Saturday morning. Reporting live from East Hollywood, Jacqueline Sarkeesian, KTLA 5 News.